everyone, welcome to my channel where we talk about the things we love like gaming, shows, and anime. One thing I love to discover the most in my spare time with games are the Easter eggs. There are so many Dragon Ball Z games out there, so you know I'll be back with some more after this list. So I hope you enjoy what's in store for you today. Let's begin! Number 10. In Legacy of Goku 2, you can have access to a scouter, letting you analyze people and view their power level and such. But if you find Marin and view her with the scouter, it will say it cannot detect any brain waves. Perhaps the scouter is broken. Number 9. In Super Dragon Ball Z, Chi Chi can wear her old outfit that she wore as a kid. Pretty hot when an adult wears it. This is an easter egg because we never see her wear this outfit in any other game as an adult. Number 8. In Budokai 3, if you choose the Cybermen against Yamcha and use self-destruct, you will kill Yamcha no matter how many life bars he has. His body lies down the exact same way as he did when he was killed by the Cyberman in the series. This does not work with anyone else, not even Mr. Satan. Number 7. In the Dragon Ball Z Tenkaichi games like Tag Team, depending on who you team up with, the team will interact with each other before the fight. This also happens with Tenkaichi 2 and 3 where there are so many interaction quotes. They are very interesting to hear as some team ups in Tenkaichi Tag Team are funny and in Tenkaichi 2 and 3 games their interactions are fun to hear because of the amount of characters in the game that actually have a different quote for everyone they know. Number 6. In Dragon Ball Z Legacy of Goku 2, in Hercule City you go to the Circuit Shack, the electronics store, and you'll notice a Game Boy Advance on the table. Also, there will be game copies of Final Fantasy II, Legend of Zelda A Link to the Past, Secret of Mana, Super Metroid, Mega Man X, and Chrono Trigger. Number 5. In Dragon Ball Z Super Sonic Warriors 2, look at the crowd in the Martial Arts World Tournament stage. You will see Eraser, Sharpner on the left side of the arena, and on the right side you will see Chi Chi, Bulma, and the Ox King with the audience. Number 4. Again, going back to Super Sonic Warriors 2, look at the box art. It shows Kid Buu, but Kid Buu isn't even a playable character in the game. You instead play as Fat Buu and Super Buu. I guess this is more of a mess up than an easter egg, or what do you think? Number 3. In Dragon Ball Z Budokai Tenkaichi 3, go to the Versus menu where Nappa is with Vegeta. They tell you what the options are on this menu. Wait for a while without pressing any buttons and Nappa will say, Hey, you think if I went Super Saiyan my goatee will grow? When I first discovered this, I was actually talking to my friend about that, questioning whether Nappa's goatee would turn blonde or would he sprout hair if he went Super Saiyan 3. Then Nappa said this quote, Boy, were we spooked. Number 2. Yet another easter egg for Dragon Ball Z Super Sonic Warriors 2. This is the only Dragon Ball Z game that has New Planet Vegeta as a stage. Number 1. This one took some patience to go through. In Dragon Ball Z Super Butoden 2, we take a look at the title screen. Yes, it's cool and creative, but that's not why we're here. If you don't press any buttons for about a minute or so, the game will direct you to a demo where it has the CPU going up against itself to demonstrate how the fighting is. The demo lasts about a few minutes and then it goes back to the intro of the title screen. Nothing new happens here. It will repeat the process over and over. But if you have some patience, wait till it does this over 7 times and when you get to the title screen again. This time, Mr. Pobo will peek out out of the Dragon Ball Z logo, and then go back to hiding. Now, here's a bonus. If you still continue to not press any buttons and let the process repeat for yet another 7 times, this time, at the title screen, Piccolo appears from far away and performs a key blast to an opponent off screen. Like I said, this one takes a major patience to view, but so does looking for easter eggs. Well, that's it for today's top 10 list. I hope you enjoyed the video. If so, put a thumbs up. And if there are any other videos you would love to see, please let me know in the comments. Also, post up any comments, funny ones or whatever ones you can think of. 
I put the best comments up in my videos whenever I see some really good ones. And if you want to see more of my videos, be sure to hit the subscribe button. It really helps me out a lot. And I'll be sure to let you know when I post up more videos. This is Score saying, have an awesome day.